Active voice. The subject does the verb. Sentence has a direct object. It places the blame at the beginning of the sentence. There cannot be a helping or to be verb. The main verb ends in ing or en. Passive voice. The subject does not have a direct object. Helping verbs in the sentence may place blame at the end of the sentences. Does not show who the subject is, not placing the blame on anyone. The subject in the sentence does not do the action to the direct object. A good indication that a sentence is in passive voice is to look for a helping verb such as was. Call. Hit the pot into the cup. The difference between active and passive voice is active voice does the action while passive voice receives the action. In this sentence, Cole hit the putt into the cup. Cole is the subject. Hit is the verb. Cup is the direct object. To change it, you would write it as the putt was hit into the cup by Cole. Nick hit the eight ball into the pocket. Nick hit the eight ball into the pocket. This is an active voice sentence. To change it into passive voice, you first have to say that Nick is the subject, hit is the verb, pocket is direct object. To change it to passive voice, you would write it as the eight ball was hit into the pocket by Nick. The dog barked at Cole. An example of passive voice is Cole was barked at by the dog. To change it, you first have Cole, the subject, was the helping verb, dog, the direct object. To rewrite the sentence, you'd write it as the dog barked at uh,